Seven years ago, 15-month-old Marcus White Jr. was shot and killed while he was at a picnic with his family in East Hills. Investigators found that baby Marcus's aunt tried to shield him when the gunfire erupted. And the case has been active for eight years, but tonight there is a development as a suspect is behind bars. Good evening and thanks for joining us at 11. I'm Megan Schiller in for Paul Martino. This afternoon, police took a 22-year-old into custody and he's accused of pulling the trigger. Shelby Cassessi has more tonight as Marcus's family is reacting to the news. The family's attorney is calling this arrest bittersweet. On one hand, baby Marcus's family is potentially another step closer to getting justice. But on the other hand, it's taken over seven years to reach this point. Here's a picture of the suspect. This is 22-year-old Gregory Parker, who is now charged with criminal homicide, criminal conspiracy, aggravated assault, and gun charges. He was brought here to police headquarters today before he was taken to the Allegheny County Jail. We spoke with the attorney representative presenting baby Marcus's family on the steps of the city county building tonight. He claims police had a confession years ago from Parker and alleges police avoided making an arrest to use Parker for information on another case. Now he's asking Allegheny County District Attorney Stephen Zappala to step away from this case. He decided to, to trade a, somebody who confessed to murdering a baby so that he can get a conviction on two innocent defendants. And and it's entirely unacceptable and we will not accept this individual be being in charge of the prosecution of Marcus's killer going forward. He also says he will be filing a lawsuit Monday against the Palace office, Allegheny County Police and the United States for an ATF agent's role in the investigation. Now, police have not told us what evidence led to the arrest of Parker and why the arrest happened today. Police have also not said whether or not they got that confession years ago, like this family alleges. Reporting outside of Pittsburgh Police Headquarters, Shelby Cassassi, KDK News.